All right, hello, <coughs> friends and neighbors, and welcome to the next level. And I'm the next level of uh, tipsy, because I've been having some of them long islanders. So anyway, finally the conclave don't screw with us, and we're going to get a chance to use Zera tool to do some stuff. Yeah, so anyway, only their weird, goofy, Dark Templar energies can destroy the Cerebrate. We don't even know really what the main beef between the Protoss and the Dark Templars are. Why, like, what made them, like, so pissy pants with one another. But it doesn't really matter. This mission's kind of fun. We get a chance to rain down some death from above, which is, fun, which is pretty cool. Man, Tester looks like a doggy, doesn't he? Just the way this shown, it makes it look like he has a long nose and he's furry. You know, he's like a, like a German Shepherd's type face there. Even though I'm sure his face is supposed to be flat. But anyway, these aren't too bad. This mission isn't too bad. We're just gonna have to... My strategy's a little weird. Some people may employ it, some people may not. But uh, at least we're fighting the Zerg again. So the Zerg, we have like asymmetric advantages, as do they over us. But I'd rather fight that way than fight Zerg on Zerg. Fight Zerg on Zerg is lame. Start with an Arbiter. Pretty cool. And so we need to move forward to a location that has some gosh darn... Oh, wait. That's uh, not what we wanted to do at all. So anyway, we'll back off back to here. And I understand you can actually beat this level fairly quickly. So anyway, here's the crystal patch. And I think if we build that there, that's for the best. Because the one thing is far away, the gas thing. So we'll try to do, we'll try to be everything to everyone, which is rather stupid. Okay. That's cool, so let's just hang out. All right, we're going to want to build ourselves. And they're going to use defilers, which is fairly annoying. Okay. So anyway, since we got the Arbiter... We've got the advantage to be able to do the deal, so we're going to uh, we're gonna get up front here. Now, obviously, in the absence of any hittable units, the computer's gonna try to murder our poor uh, our uh, poor visible units, which you know it would be rather problematic. Might as well, just keep building these while we got them, right? But yeah, this part's going to be all about uh, preserving our force pretty much as long as we can. Just build one right here. Okay. Good. You guys get some minerals ready to go here. But yeah, that's the thing is obviously the Arbor is going to get all kinds of shots taken at it. Because it's like, oh cool. Already done. Good. Oh, we've already got enough supplies so we can get going. We're obviously going to build some pro uh, photon cannons here. The enemy is going to make liberal use of defilers to come like plague our stuff, which is rather annoying. But if we make sure that our units are in the back, then they won't really get affected. It'll just be our buildings, and that's okay because, you know, uh, pylons are cheap. Pylons are cheap. Cannons are mostly cheap. There might be some air attacks from here. You can see this ledge up here. And if, you, uh, if you're if you not picking up what I'm putting down, the first place I'm going to go is up here. There's an expansion up there, but also we have the ability to photon cannon the crap out of a couple of places. 
and make this place nearly impervious to attack, which is something we're going to want to do sooner instead of later. There's also like an identically shaped camp on the other side of this canyon, like over here. And we'll eventually jump on that as well. But uh, for now, we need to grow our, uh, our worker fleet, obviously, just like any other, just like any other level, we'll do the exact same thing we always do. The attacks will start off pretty weak, but they'll get stronger. Once we take that hill, they're gonna unload some serious hate and discontent on us, but that does not bother me. That does not bother me too much. So bossy. You hear that stuff? Hey, James. Hey, why do you quit being so bossy and so loud? She is. What a turd. God darn kids. Anyway, so as we continue, I knew I should have finished this before they came back from visiting their grandfather. Oh well. Uh, so anyway, we're building the gateway. That's great. Gateway computers. We're gonna need to build that cybernetic core. But that's two hundred dollar offs. We build a forge. How about that? Uh, the enemy will make liberal use of all kinds of terrible units, uh, like I said, to include defilers, but will also include uh, guardians. So yeah, we can go in there and get these guys, no big deal. You'd be like, oh my god, we're being attacked by nothing. Aha! Cool. Alright, let's all back off here. We want to maintain this force intact, whole, as long as we can through clever tactics, you know what I mean? Unfortunately, we are gonna have to deal with that, those guys right there. And then if you take a look at this, now we've got an assimilator, or we will have an assimilator, up and we'll have some gases. You can see it's kind of far away. Um, it's not as far away as it could be, because a lot of people's initial instinct is to put their nexus right there, which is not a bad idea under normal circumstances, but obviously these are not normal circumstances. So yeah, whatever. Uh, we're gonna be a little bit gas poor, but that doesn't ex it doesn't really... Ah, great gravy. Really? That's all we got? All right, it's fine. I'm not too worried about that guy, actually, to be honest with you. But we are going to have to build some, some cannons. I mean, that's... That is a thing. So they won't last too long as our dragoons. Dragoons pretty tough. Pretty tough stuff there. Well, we will need to start setting up our uh, our uh, passive defense. Kind of. Oh, we start off with a thousand. I didn't see. It. We start off with a thousand, and we're gonna want that robotics facility for sure. Yeah, that robotics facility will be highly helpful when it comes to. Well, we're gonna want reavers, of course, but more than reavers, we're gonna want. Uh, the Gravitons, or shuttles, the Graviton is the upgrade. But we're going to have to be very ready for all kinds of terrible attacks against our, our August persons, or something. But anyway, so far so good. So far so good. Okay, good. I want to set up a pylon over here. For some defensive backup but yeah we probably were not gonna have enough money to be spitting out enough money and gas to be spitting out uh, a bunch of scouts because that's not really gonna work too well we 
will we will want a reaver or two to go up for siegeological purposes obviously uh, but for now we're looking pretty good why are you so loud now yeah, whatever all right all right build that robotic support bay kind of building all the deals right here cool and I'm not really gonna make good use of this arbiter if you're wondering like wow it's gonna do that arbiter the answer is not a whole heck of a lot uh, I really don't have a lot of use for him to be honest with you now, let, me, let, me, let me build one of those guys just as like a, at least a stop gap cool we got one of these and we'll have another soon I right, don't take any gas it's pretty cool all right, everything is going along pretty swimmingly right now. Uh, we're not going to have too much of a force ready to go up that hill. Not too large of a force. So we're going to have to start preparing these guys. Uh, we might even bring them up piecemeal. Because the computer really will not react very strongly to our attacks. Until we're really got, you know, stuff going in force. Then they're going to get... They're gonna get PO'd, man. They're gonna get PO'd, as we used to say back in the old days. I remember I got trolled for saying that. I was a kid for saying PO'd. It's like, ah, oh, you said PO'd in front of your grandmother. I was like, why? What's wrong with that? It's not a curse word. It's like, oh yeah, what does it stand for? So, you know, I think it was kind of, that was kind of BS if you ask me. But uh, anyway, we got four set up here. We'll take that hill, and that hill is an important hill to take. It'll give us a commanding position. It'll give us our first expansion, and that commanding position will also allow us will allow us to do some big time damage up there. But uh, yeah, we might have to bring our force up uh, piecemeal. That's just the way it probably may have to be. So we got a couple of shuttles here. That's cool, whatever. And I'm probably going to need another pylon. Uh, I just... Put one of these here and see if we can get away with it. Oh. Get on in, boys. We're gonna have to just kind of maneuver him around a little bit so he can not get hit too hard. He did get he did get one of my uh, photon cannons, which is kind of turds. But uh, what are you gonna do about it? Yeah. Oh no! No, run away! Run away bravely! Oh! Like the majority of my force got slimed. And by slimed, I mean defiled. Which is bad news bears. Because these guys will all go down to one hit point. Which is, you know, obviously suboptimal. It's not really what we want. Zeratul didn't get hit with it, which I'm happy about. But yeah, these little, these little turds will be there forever and anon as well. I was hoping that most of my force would not fall victim to that, but they did. All right, let's go take this guy out. But we're about ready to lay in with the heavy artillery anyway. So you guys can, you know, whatever you want, but uh, you're about to get moited. Oh! What a bunch of bull crap. These guys do have an air-to-air -air attack. Alright, cool. So there's your defiler right there. And they're just gonna kinda sit there until such time as they don't sit there. I was hoping to stay back so we would not be defiled by the defiler. But uh, in any case, it worked out okay. All right, 
right, so let's bring our healthy dude up. And we're gonna we're gonna just drop him off upstairs. And these guys are slow, but what are you gonna do, right? I think I'll go with the pow pack before I go with the fun pack. <clears throat> we're just gonna drop these guys wherever. Well, not wherever. Hopefully, what will happen here is the pressure will be taken off the, the basement and will be put upon the hill. No, no, don't waste your ammo on him. I want you to take out that. You drop those guys off yet, yeah, dude? No. What the fudge? There you are. Get up there, idiot. Did I hockey that? Good, I hockey that. Where's my other ship? Good, it's here. Because we definitely... I want you to attack the thing that's an actual threat, please. Oh, here we go. Big attack coming in. Inbound attack. That's fine. I uh, can see us anyway, so it doesn't make any difference. Which is too bad, but that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and replace that real quick. Unfortunately, he attacked the thing I didn't want him to attack, but that's okay, I guess. It's okay enough. Cool. He bought up there. Oh, come on. I feel like I have enough minerals. But I guess my feelings don't count. Oh well. Anyway. So, so far, so okay. As far as I know, I don't think there's anybody else up here to really worry about. But I could be wrong about that. They do have a few defensive structures that we might want to worry about eventually. But for now, okay, cool. Yeah, I just want to see there's some gas here. So you see that, that hillside right there? That is a very cool area that we can do some cool stuff from. It's very cool. And I mean, you know, coolly high harmony and such. A lot of gas, too. That's pretty nice. All right, we have to save up enough for a nexus. So the idea is here very soon I'm going to uh, get myself a... Uh, what's the word for it? Get myself a nexus, but I'm gonna get something else to get this expansion going because I don't think we're, we're not exactly running out here But we're not exactly in the money either and we gotta save up for the nexus and this overhang area Like if properly fortified which it will be properly fortified obviously will give us the ability to prevent Pretty much prevent attacks against us emanating uh, from the Reds. Well, from anybody, really, because that's their point of ingress. Now, they will be able to do um, air attacks, and we're going to run into those. We're going to run into Guardians. We're going to run into nasty crap like that. That's going to happen, and it's going to happen soon. So we're going to want to get some scouts pumped out uh, soon. But for now, the most important thing to me is this right here. So now that I'm saved up, now I can start thinking about other stuff. And then, uh-oh. You guys want to help out or what? Ah, crap. Ah. I do like Zara Tool's lightsaber there, that's pretty sweet. And it even makes the lightsaber sound the sound, which I think is pretty neat. <laughs> I wonder where he's at. So I'm gonna rebuild that. Okay, 
Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna build that star port just yet. Star. Yeah. Oh god, now that's bad news bears right there. Because I really don't have the wherewithal to screw with them. But that's okay. Because I'm gonna pull. I, actually, I do have a little bit of the wherewithal. Because he can do nothing against them. Although this does kind of suck. He's a pregnant. Gonna... There we go. Cool. Might as well hit him while we're at it, right? Cool, whatever. Okay. Yeah, I do need to get this freaking uh, uh, Stargate spaceport, whatever. Need to get that off the ground because we are rapidly approaching the time where that's a good idea. Where the heck's my... Okay, there we go. Oh, cool. All right, so that's built. So we need to get on this now. We're actually fairly good on gas. The... Uh, The rest of our gassy needs will be taken care of uh, when we conquer some more camps. There's a camp right across the way, but having to defend that, that camp on two sides is, uh, is just a little bit annoying. Now, we're going to get into a situation here where we're going to be overlooking a camp up here, uh, a red, red uh, enemy camp, and we're going to have to, red enemy, red China camp, but uh, in order to do that, and we're going to need to uh, have our butts. Basically, we're going to need to put that, slip that stuff in, grow it, build it up, and then we'll start getting like destroyed by photon. Yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna be a little, it's gonna be a little dicey. It's not gonna be easy to go. But that's okay. That's okay, and that's all right. And move your butt all day, all night. Okay, good. Back, bring your, bring your stuff back. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and make him kill a group nine. Okay, good. Or not kill a group nine, but kill her, uh, kill a group, uh, kill her uh, building nine. Uh, cool. We're probably gonna need another gateway, that's for sure. That's why I built that pylon up there, so we build another gateway. We are gonna eventually run into some like pretty heavy duty attacks against this area, and it's gonna be pretty annoying. really too bad that's why you don't get too close to the front right all right I don't think it'll actually take him down to zero or to one or maybe it will because it's close enough now okay so now we've got this building here Whoa! Yeah, there's a, not a huge enemy force, but it's enough. Ah, I remember this happening. Uh, but unfortunately, just because I knew it happened before, doesn't mean I was ready for it this time. Not so bad, though. I've seen worse. Alright, so anyway, that's fine. Alright, so, yeah. Get you boys out of here. But yeah, they do like to do those uh, goofy attacks against your... Uh... Yeah, he is out of like zero. Yeah, there you go, Defiler, you little shit. God, I hate the Defilers. Big time. Okay, that's okay though. We're about ready to start building up our uh, force. Which would be nice. Which would be real nice. Death Team 6. And should be good. Should be in a good position. And I'd like to upgrade that fun pack upgrade, but I'm really not feeling good about our money position right now. So, 
Let's not do that yet. But let's be on the lookout, Bolo and Yolo, for chances for success. So I think we're in good shape right now. Oh, shoot, we got a dude up here. Let's drop him off here. Okay, cool. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to build one photon cannon here, even though obviously that's not enough to really do a whole heck of a lot. But it'll make me feel better. And now I'm going to begin the process of being a sneaky little turd. Okay, yeah, see this? See this? God dang it. I need to move these boys up. So the cool thing is, of course, we can shoot downward onto this guy. Oh, crap. Okay, you guys want to, like, actually do something? God dang it, that's annoying. All right. So that's, that's a problem. It's a rather annoying problem. Okay. But I've got four of these guys, and I know just what to do with them. So if I get this guy here, build a pylon. I want to build a pylon right in the middle. And then after that... So if we can get away with laying that pylon there, then we'll, we will be in a, in a just great position. Where at? Where at? What's this going on? Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 boys, 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 come help. Jesus, Louise. Nothing, no, 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 I'm sorry. Boys, I meant at boys as in military forces. Sorry. All right, so that was a little annoying, but actually, in the end, it couldn't prevent the Pilgrim's Progress, which is a book I have not read and actually don't know what covers. But unfortunately, that's funny. I said, boys, boys, help. And then they thought, my boys thought I was talking to them. But in reality, I was talking to my, my boys, my military boys, uh, who I wanted to come help me because I was getting attacked in a manner most foul. Okay, so yeah, like I said, the enemy is not going to let me have this place easily. Uh, but luckily for us, it doesn't really matter because this is really going to be painful for them. Whoa, here we go. Whoa, look at that. Now there's a big, there's a big attack. Okay, let's go ahead and move these units up here. Because, yeah, we're going to get that kind of bull crap going on. Uh, we've got to defend. No, don't. Attack the attackers, dude. That's annoying. That was very annoying that they were able to take that down. I'm not happy about that at all. Since we had all that set up very nicely here. That's okay, though. Get in there, jerks. Oh, did I lose the unit? No, I didn't. Got that right. That's all right, okay, cool. So yeah, with enough. Okay, I need to get him the hell out of here. Okay, whoa, whoa, stop, stop, stop. Boys, get back. There you go. No, you too. There's no need to go yet. So they're not going to take his line down, unfortunately. Oh, crap. But, little by little, we're going to wear him out. Provided. Oh god. Oh crap, he's out of ammo too. Oh, now I did actually lose one of these guys. Okay, cool. That's fine, that's fine. Well, it's mostly fine. I 
we gotta keep up the action here. But you see, I've taken all the heat off these guys, which is kind of nice in a way, but in another way, it's not really that nice. All right, well, you guys jump in the damn ship. So this is cool, though. Now, now we've got them kind of where we want them. Kind of where we want them. And if we play our cards right, one, we'll be able to knock out their ability to grow Hydralis, I think. They probably have another Hydralis then somewhere. But that's definitely something I'd like to be involved in, is destroying. Oh, there you go again. There we go. Yeah, we kind of, kind of come in here and take our shots and get our shots in at this guy. It's really a good deal. We can back off when they start actually fighting back, but we can get some damage, and then now they have to back off. So it's kind of a kind of like a cat and mouse tie style uh, game right here. So it's you know it's okay. Okay. Okay, and now our air fleet's getting a little bit stronger, a little bit stronger. So the hope is that one, we, after we take this guy out, which is really what we want here because we want to be able to step forward without taking damage, which is kind of been going on. We also don't want to be able to land things, which is nice if we could do that. Okay, cool. All right, excellent, excellent. Now, unfortunately, these rapscallions. Oh, whoa, get up there, boys. Help them out. Help them out, boys. All right, take, take the death and destruction up the side now. Whoa, you guys get back because you're actually vulnerable to attack from that guy. Whereas everybody here is in no way that's fine he can take it all right now we want to cut off one side from the other which is you know which is a pretty cool deal if we can get away with it and it's definitely something we're about to do oh uh, at least we'd like to all right So yeah, so as we clear this out, now we can start establishing a defensive perimeter up here, a defensive offensive perimeter, kind of a blockade style perimeter. And that's really what I want to do because there's a camp down there that we can take over and make it impossible for them to, uh, what's the word for it? Oh, I probably put those guys down and probably didn't have them too crap, did I? Uh, whoops. That's okay. Not too worried about that. Ah, oh, they killed my darn probe though, didn't they? Sure they did. All right. Oh, we're under attack over here. That's fine. Go get them, boys. There we go. Step back, cause this is darn freaking defiler around. Oh, what are you doing? Now that is highly distressing. That's that's just freaking dumb right there. All right, whatever. Back to whatever. But she's doing a whole lot of nothing. I have to wait till I get some money together now. Okay, let's let's help out here, boys. Okay, no, okay. All 
All right, cool. Now, occasionally we get attacks from the whites. And that's not a big deal. Are you going to attack or what? No. I mean, you're the one. Okay, this should put us in pretty good shape right now. that particular offensive. All right. Better go do something about him quick. That's unfortunate because this is a distraction and obviously this is not the main uh, theater of battle. Uh, but this is kind of what we wanted to happen here. Okay, cool. We've got our ex another plane now, which is good because we're going to want them help us out and uh, okay so yeah, as you can see yeah you can see our reach is pretty far now which is exactly what we want and we got a uh, we got one of those guys no we don't okay oh shoot I didn't realize we had these two dudes so let's get them ready all right so anyway there's there's a camp up here and we're gonna we're gonna want to drop in on them for a little surprise. I don't know why they they like you know you can carry up to four dudes, but for some reason they are carrying one. I'm not really sure why you'd want to do that. Okay. So while we're here, let's go see if we can get away with doing some uh, some skullduggery here. take out these guys because they have no uh, they have no sights so or they have no ability to hit us and they have nobody backing them up so it's whoa whoa whoa, whoa, whoa. sorry about that boys uh, I kind of screwed that up but that's okay not the first time I ever screwed something up all right where's the gosh darn guy there okay good okay good uh, let's get the fun pack. So anyway, uh, I know our pace is kind of glacial. Sorry about this. Uh, that second. Uh, Long Islanders really getting me, get me pretty good there. All right, cool. But we're about to kick it into high gear, I guess, or whatever. So yeah, where's our freaking? Oh, good, good. We never landed them. Are we? Were we making another one? No, we're making another one either. Okay, so. All right, whatever. Who cares? All right, let's let's get this guy in here. And how about uh, you and you, not you, cripple, and you all get in this freaking ship here, and you guys are gonna go out on the ground. So the thing is, the cool thing is, we've we've sliced ourselves a little territory where we can operate freely, more or less. So that's good, and our air power can really come through for us here. And now we've made. Anybody trying to advance against us from this Y, we've put them in a pretty bad position, which is exactly what you want to do, obviously. Put the enemy in a bad position. And, uh, yeah. It's pretty good. Pretty happy about it. So let's get a couple of you dudes, get you in a ship as well, and we will slowly start creeping up. So you see, there is a... Cool. Uh-oh. Oh, that's bad. OK, 
Okay, and we want to definitely make sure he's full on ammo. I probably should have hockeyed him, but I have not. So whatever. The cool part is, of course, reinforcements will be slow in the coming. Just kind of want to keep myself uh, whatever here. Kind of. Actually, if we can go whale on it, let's whale on it, right? Good. Okay, let's hang back. Oh, they're good. There's no defensive structures here. What did I do with the guy? Yeah, there you go. Get in there, you idiots. So this should all go pretty well. And see, as these guys try to go in to reinforce, they're all, like, uh, confronted with the fact that, uh, you know, they can't do crap. Okay. Okay, you guys can back off if you want here for a minute. And anybody who gets through... I mean, it's kind of a lazy, or not lazy deal, it's a lucky deal to get through. Which... Yeah, so this is pretty cool. I mean, it's pretty cool to watch, like, how, like, you dorks are totally screwed. You know? And, and yeah, I mean, you can do your whatever, but it's not really going to help you too much. At best, you're attacking my passive defenses. All right, cool. I think, yeah, there's an Ultralisk right there, which I sure would like to kill if I can. So, you want to get him with a good one? There you go. There we go, cool. Because I, I, I want to take out this passive defense here. Um, I guess it's not really that important. But I want to take out some of this creep, it, certainly, so I can so I can use this territory to my advantage, right? So, pretty nice. So you see, yeah, see these guys are getting they're getting their uh, they're getting their whatever. They're getting their money's worth there, they're getting their shots in. I think if I spot for that guy. No, he can't hit him, that's too bad. But still you gotta be careful because the whole the whole rest of this place it's all like uh, uh, spawn uh, spore colonies. That's the end of him. Okay, cool. All right, let's go down here and build some uh, some more of these dudes. So we're in good shape uh, up to this point, so everybody can kind of. Breathe easy on that uh, front. And there's another hill we can take, which we will take in a minute, but we can't quite can't quite take it yet. Now we probably don't need to create many more forces up top there. But that is not the end of our aerial assaults. I can I can uh, sadly guarantee you that. So we're gonna take a bunch of these guys because now we're running out of darn resources. But it's kind of fun how we can do this. Now the whites are still around and they're a pain, but they're not really gonna become too much of an issue, provided our air defenses stay tight, which I guarantee they will. Uh, they will occasionally try to drop some stuff here and there. But the reds are still around. They're not uh, particularly vibrant, I wouldn't say, but they will be an issue. They can be an issue. I want to say they will be an issue because I mean, I'm going to do everything I can to make sure they won't. But we do need to... Ah, see, there we go. The whites love the air assaults. They're big on them. Or not air assaults, the air, uh, air attacks. And they've got they've got the guardians. Like, look, at, look at how many guardians. Luckily for us, that's not really a big deal. I mean, they're going to take out some... Oh, I took out a Dragoon, which is unfortunate. But, uh... I took out a Dragoon and a couple of uh, cannons, which... It's a thing, but it's not a big thing. I didn't realize how close, how, like, out of resources I am right now. Uh, 
is how broke ass I have become. Alright, what's going on here? I don't know what the heck he's doing. But I do appreciate that he uh, he's doing it poorly, whatever that is he's doing. Alright, cool. So we're back in business. Dang, I didn't realize how close I came to like being completely broke. Anyway, so what do we got to do now? Well, the thing we got to do now is we got to come up with another one of these shuttles. Yep, alright. And we've got to transport some units to take the other hill. Which I think the other, I think the other hill is pretty uh, much, uh, there's nobody there. It could be. I hope so. But I'll send these guys to just go make sure. And I, I think I can pretty much take that other uh, settlement over here at will, by the way. Okay, let me see. Oh, what are you doing? Get to work. We probably won't have to worry about attacks happening here. As far as I remember. Okay, so we've got this guy here. And uh, who else? What are the jokers we're going to take along? Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay, where's our where's our boy at? Sorry. Kinda of coming up blank on all this stuff here. Alright. So far so good. Uh where is my other uh, shuttle? Can't find him. Ah oh, there we go. Okay, cool. Cool, we got four of these guys, put them in. Alright. We need to get these idiots together. Okay, cool. One, two, we got one more. Three. Excellent. Alright. Oh, okay, so let's go ahead and... Uh, okay, alright, there's another spawn con... Or not spawn, or creep con. But basically, this was the hardest part of the game, right here. And now that we've completed it, we can be pretty confident that the game's pretty much almost over. It's going to take a little while, but it's all over by the shouting right now. Which I'm happy about. Now we'll take this other hill, uh, but i got to do a little scouting here, because I can't remember exactly what's on it. Okay, so it's not a big deal here. And like I said, there's an identical camp on the other side, which we will take very quickly. And then there's another red camp, which is not identical, but it's a red camp anyway. What the hell is that over there? Oh, okay. It's whatever is what it is. But we'll, you know, we'll, we don't have to take out this other red camp, but it's a good idea because the last thing we want to do is have to put up with some big butt red camp that's going to cause all sorts of damage to us, you know? Oh, crap. Okay, let's run away bravely just for a moment. Because uh, the last thing I want to have to do is deal with too many enemy uh, defenders there, you know, and big time losses. And I can always just land my fork. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Anyway. So I think we'll be in good shape if we come down here. So that's what I'm going to do. I don't think we need to really rely on our offense, our, our air offensive capabilities. Oh, no, 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 no. Get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. 
There we go. That's good. Okay. All right. You guys just kind of hang if you could. If you'd be so kind. I'll make you death team four. And you guys go kind of back over here. And let's get uh, death team six to work. Cool. Where are you going? Oh, yeah. That's right. Yeah, you want to take a picture of it? Yeah, I'll be back in a second. Craziness. Okay, anyway, there's a big storm rolling. I had to, I had to look for a second. Ugh. Well, that's kind of crappy. Uh, yeah, what am I doing? Okay, I gotta get to move in here or I'm gonna end up dying. So, let's uh, let's make sure we keep moving. I need a, a probe or two as well. What the fudge? Hey, you guys wanna do something about all this or are you just gonna sit around? Dorks. Uh-oh. Oh, wow, look at that. Pretty beautiful last ditch effort there, jerks. Okay, let's uh, let's get uh, let's get. Uh, oh crap. Okay, well yeah, at least get one of you guys right. Oh no no no! Come on, where ah? I lost sight of what was going on. That's my fault, of course. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And when the whites attack, you can expect... You can expect guardians. They specialize in the air units. That's not a big deal. They don't do a lot of... Yeah, so they don't do a lot of dollars worth of damage. It's annoying, but it's okay. All right, cool. We've cleared the hill. Oh, yeah, get him, please. Oh, God. Free fire. How about... There we go. Whoa. That was beautiful. Oh, but they did, they did manage to kill one of Death Team 4, which I was not happy about. And unfortunately, this guy decided he's going to go up and be Mr. Hero. Hmm. All right, all right, all right. God dang it. Okay, I thought I sent a bunch of probes up. And by a bunch, I mean like two of them. Where at? Okay, you guys need to back the F off. Okay, hey, back the F off. There's no crystals up there. That's okay. God dang it, back off. You guys are such idiots. All right. All right, all right, all right. Now I gotta find my deal that has the probes in it, right? It should be somewhere around where I thought there were probes. Oh, there's one probe with like no energy. That's great. All right, well that's fine. So yeah, get over here. Cause I'm probably gonna set up one to produce some gas or whatever, which is kind of cool. It's fine. It's. But that's kind of stupid. Cause why would I do that? Because. I've already got this place down here that I haven't developed yet. So you can see how we've got this big uh, place that we can pretty much lay siege to at any time we want. Uh, I'm going to build that nexus first. So let's just hold this for a little bit longer. And these guys are working up here. I hope. Yeah, they're working. Um, and we can take this one over here. So let's let's do that because this, is, this ground is pretty much secure. The reds really don't have the wherewithal to do a whole heck of a lot. And I'm just going to put this right here. Because we're so good on gas. Like, these gas guys are over here. These gas guys are here, too. We don't really need to worry about gas very much. So, yeah. We're more worried about minerals at this point. So, as you can guess, I'm definitely going to make, like, a death from above type setup here. Uh, but it's going to be a minute. 
Because I need to save up the money. Mm. I'm sorry if I'm not being very entertaining. I'm just really starting to feel these Long Islanders. Um, but yeah, the last thing I want to do right now is draw me fire. I'm going to take it nice and easy. Nice and slow, you know? So I'm going to build this because i got the money to do it. And then after that, I'm going to build a photon cannon. I don't know what... Oh, we better take this guy out. I don't like the looks of him. I don't like how he's looking at me. He's leering. He's leering at me. Okay, good. Get back. Good. Whoa, we got brown. We got brown guys. With the brown team. The brown note team. In route. And they do have the super roidy zergs. Get in there, boys. Yeah, they do. Okay. So this should be enough to break up any kind of fun they're trying to have here. I hope. Whoa, 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 what's going on here? Not too worried. Oh, god dang it. Now it's starting to hit with the medium-sized artillery. Whoa, did somebody just plague me up, bro? Alright, whatever. Alright, Probe, do me a favor. Give me a, give me a couple more cannons. Hey, Mario, it looks like it's going to, like, uh, typhoon outside. Don't you think you should go home before? I mean, it's, it, I heard it thunder already. Yeah. So, so he may, don't, well, he may stay. Oh, great. I don't really know what to do right now. Well, I think he, I think he should probably go home now before the storm hits. Ah, oh, crap on a crutch. Look at this crap. Alright, it's fine. Not a big deal. It's just a little annoying that we gotta run here and there and everywhere. I guess it would be smarter. Whoa, how did that get destroyed? Oh, wow. They, they split their attack force, which that's highly unusual. I don't know what the heck his idea is. Hey, Mario, go home! Hey, hey, Mario, go home before the friggin' The storm's gonna hit in a minute here, buddy. Oh, boy. See you later, Mario. Uh, don't, don't waste too much time, buddy. That's the... Okay, anyway, all right, so things are going good. I'm sorry I had to get the uh, my kid's friend out of the house before the Class 5 kill storm came up. So we're eventually going to actually sally forth here with this uh, force that we have. Huh? What do you mean? There's no rain yet. Okay, cool. Okay, I already heard you guys. You gonna say it again? He already left, didn't he? Okay, James, or Mom. Okay, Mom, give the boy a ride home. Mom. Whatever. The storm's about to hit. Give the boy a ride home. He's, uh... Does he have a car? What? 
Give the boy a ride home. Oh, God. You, you better to hurry this up before the storm actually hits, guys. Why did you ask Jamesy if he wants to come? Oh, God. Okay, this is kind of neat or whatever. Yeah, and the storm is about to hit. Sorry about this, folks. I had to have a... Because I don't know why that kid was still here. Because, like, we saw the storm coming in. Anyway, he's just down the street anyway. So it's not really a big deal. So, whatever. Anyway, so as you can see here, we can hit them with a bit of impunity. And I need to, I need to get some more ground forces. Though. I'm sorry. And I'm sorry this is taking so long. I should probably do this better and faster and whatever. But for, for now... You little sh turds. Let's see if we can get a shit. We can take this guy out right here. Okay, not not with impunity, I'm afraid. Although I'm sure we can do something like that. Okay, guys, let's not. And unfortunately. God dang it, what are you doing? Hit that guy. Oh, jeez. I'm sure it's my fault somehow. There we go. Good. Back off. And then I don't know if we like... Do I have a good hotkey for that? I think I do. Anyway. Whoa. Why that storm got wild almost immediately. Whoa. Well, unfortunately, I should, should have put my forces closer to my much vaunted uh, capabilities up there. That's my fault. But remember, I am fairly drunk right now. And uh, I could have done a lot better in most things in my life. Wow, look at all the forces they got going. Huh? They're really rolling out, aren't they? Okay, stay back, stay back while we got the advantage. Use your advantageous situation, please, to your advantage. Actually, build a nexus down here. We'll, we'll get that gas, but also the ability to build more dudes. Which I, which I deem highly important. Oh, you want to take a shot at my gosh darn whatevers, huh? Yeah, I wanted to keep you away. Oh, wow. Yeah, we got quite a storm going here. That was not uh, too long after. Okay, cool. All right, all right, all right. Let's uh, let's keep working here. No, I don't want that one. Okay, cool. So it looks like this one's kind of sewn up as well. Let's see if we can get rid of that stupid hydrolyze then. I'm so tired of hydrolysis, I can tell you that. Since they obviously are a threat to my beautiful balloon. And by balloon, I mean my fighter jets here, my scouts. Cool. Alright, looks like we got them. It looks like this is pretty much the balance of their camp. And it will be finished very quickly. Whoa, what do we got here? Oh man, we got a big battle here. Okay, let's back off real quick. Really quick, let's back off. Because the last thing I want is my freaking dudes to die. Because if my dudes die, guess what? Then we lose. Oh! Oh! Oh, 
Okay. Whoa, what happened? That was nice. That they came to help. Man, that sucked. Alright. Whoa, what's he doing up here? Nobody told you to go up there, dork. But whatever. Alright, well, whatever. Well, now I gotta rebuild my military, unfortunately. Most of it, anyway. I need to keep you guys back, too, because that's the last thing I want is for you both of you to get killed. Uh, so let's build some, like, Templar archives and crap like that. What do you say? I say, great. Uh, oh god dang it yeah you can't trust these guys they're always they're always doing stuff like that oh boy look at that guy I don't want to mess with him either stupid guy I hate defilers they're, they're such little smart asses they're always always waiting to pull their smart ass schemes on you you know alright that's okay though okay we need more um we need to upgrade. We need to uh, pump out some units really badly too. So we're probably gonna need to build another frickin' uh, gateway, that's for sure. Okay, good. Just gonna shove you guys in there and see how you do. Right, I'm gonna build a Templar's archive. Not because I really give a shit about the Templars, because they don't. Oh, I didn't even build the Citadel of a Dune yet. Now, what a craptacular player I am. Alright, where the hell is my uh, shuttle that I just picked up three dudes with? No? Oh, here they are. Alright, do me a favor. Go in there and kill. I'll try to support you. Aha! To keep that ultra list away. At the very least, keep the ultra list away, right? I want you guys to go disable that. Whoa, what happened? What happened? Sorry. My reaction time is very slow, and unfortunately, we've been slaughtered here. Jeez. I didn't think they would be able to resist our awesome offensive power. But in that, I was wrong. We gave them too much time to rebuild, I suppose. All right, you know, just take that thing out. I'm tired of playing games. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Okay, there we go. There we go. Ah, I got another hydrogen. What a bunch of jerks. Well, I definitely know what my next target is. Alright. So now they're causing havoc there. Let's see. We've got the Templar. I uh, know we don't. we got the Citadel of a Dune. We've got this one. Another gateway up, good. Let's make that number seven, fine. And we'll make this number eight. Okay. All right, cool. Come on, let's destroy this darn thing. Let's let's get it over with here, right? Wow, look at the hit points on that darn thing. That's a lot of hit points. Now let's kill him real fast before he gets a chance to make any disasters for us. And then what the hell is I about to do? I wanted to upgrade, I wanted to do stuff, and I don't remember what it is now. 
whatever. I knew, oh, I didn't even give him the singularity charge. How about that, huh? That's pretty effed up. Okay, cool. That's right, I gotta build a fleet beacon. Be fleet beacon, there we go. So I can upgrade my, my fighter jets here. Cool, get him. That's the end of them. All right, cool. Uh, really meager, uh, meager proceeds from that, uh, that mission there, but uh, what are you gonna do, right? Ah, oh, again. Well, whatever. Still, we're looking pretty gosh darn good right now. And right now, I'm just basically amusing myself until we can completely destroy and get together a force. Another one? God dang, get lost. Mom, come back, Zacky. Yeah, I don't know where these guys are coming from. Anyway, it doesn't much matter. Really? We're out of pylon power? All right, give me a second now. Now that I've extinguished the reds. Other the reds do have a couple of uh, whatevers. Okay, although the reds do have, a, what's the word for it? They have a few uh, passive defenses around, but they're pretty finished. I wouldn't worry about them. Depleted, no, not depleted. There's actually a fair amount of gas left in that one. Why are you still here? For what purpose? You're a dunsy onesie, Mr. Red Man. Okay. Okay. Yeah, there we go. It almost doesn't matter if this whole place goes down, to be honest with you. I told you guys to go. But I don't... Whatever. We don't know how long this will go on for. is all mustered up. Really? Really? Oh, man. What are you guys doing? Okay, good. You know, frankly, I don't care if they destroy my camp up there. Because it's no longer of any use to us. Okay, don't chase. God dang it. So we're gonna have to go through this like narrow valley here, which is gonna be totally lame. And yes, I hate him enough that I went ahead and just... So yeah, we'll go through this narrow valley here, which is gonna suck. And I'm going to allow them to destroy my camp because it doesn't matter. And I'm gonna rally these forces up here. It's not. No, no, he's making a pylon like I asked him to. 
Did I ask him to make a pile on? I don't remember. Sure thought I did, yeah. Okay, cool. All right, so we're about ready to move out a little bit further down the road. I don't care. Destroy that camp. The camp's of no use to me anymore. Whoa. Yeah, there's queens in the air, which, you know, are favorites, of course. Okay, let's kill this thing. We're probably going to need more of these dudes for sure. Uh, let's wait till we recover from our slime time. Alright. Yeah, I get it. We're under attack, but I don't I really can't bring myself to care too much. Alright. Oh well. Whoa, hey, look at you. Ah, so yeah, so on, e on either side of the valley, we have the whites and the browns here. They're going to cause problems for us. Obviously, they have positional superiority. Because they're on top of this damn hill. This Sam Hill, I guess. Now, we could go ahead, I guess. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We definitely don't want to let that go unanswered. Okay. Really? We didn't build any pylons? Okay, cool. But there's not too much to this camp, fortunately. Okay, let's try to stay away from the spores and just get at these hydras. Take care of them. Hook them up. It'd be nice if we had some ground force up here, but we do not. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 boys, no, boys, no, boys. That's not an important building. This right here is an important building. Whoa. Although that is a fair amount of uh, death right there to put up with. Nobody built pylons? I must... And I must be drunker than I think. Oh, I think as we're getting our pylons destroyed as time goes on. Good. Alright, let's just kind of back off for a second. Oh, crap. Okay, cool. Alright, so what the heck would I want to do? Did I, did I upgrade yet? Uh, we got more upgrades to go. Good, good. Love them, love them. Alright, let's build uh, some more... Uh, build something else nice, right? And by that I mean pylons. Okay. And actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to send you guys up as harbingers of death on top of that hill and support you with air support. Now, we don't really have to do this, but it's definitely something we can do and should do and will do and are doing at this time. So, let's go ahead and do that. And unfortunately, these, these forces right here seem to be completely useless and are completely useless at this point. Man, look at all the freaking minerals over here. Oh, God, don't do that. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, that was terrible. Well, anyway. That would have been fairly cool, but... Uh, yeah, it did not work to our advantage, unfortunately. Don't attack him. Get rid of that, because I'm so sick of being attacked by, uh, whatever's, you know? I 
I don't think they're the ones who are actually sliming me. And by sliming me, I mean hit me with the uh, plague. All right, let's just go ahead and take this guy out. Let's see if we can get this one too. Yeah, you can get all those guys up if you want. It's not gonna help you. Uh, but yeah, just trying to open the way here for my boys to move up further. I think actually, in reality, I think we're probably pretty much fine moving this way. All right, probably don't need to mess with them. Yeah, this guy's got a real high rate of fire that can cause a lot of damage quickly. Uh, and they're pretty durable. I mean, they have a lot of hit points. All right, so let's go ahead and just keep kind of moving up here. I don't, to be honest, I can't really remember what's up ahead. Other than there's definitely an enemy camp up here, and it's definitely something we have to destroy. But other than that... Oh, crap. Well, you know what that means is up ahead. That means we've got a creeper. And by a creeper, I mean we've got the creepiest of all of them. All right. I mean, we've got a queen there. Ah, another one. Oh, God. What the hell, Zealot? Got a back attack coming there, huh? That's okay. I'm not too worried about it. Although, I will send these guys back as support. Yeah, it didn't last too long against this. Which is nice. Alright, let's calm down, boys. Calm down. Let's hold our water here. We've pretty much wiped out the whites there. And now... We shall continue on further. And see what else we have. Ah! Oh, I see. Well, that'll happen now, won't it? Now, this rocky land means you can't build anything. Is that, uh, yeah, that's the old ultra list. Ah! Good, I'll be happy to kill one of you jerks. So this is one of the main, uh, jerk camps. For stupid jerks. Like these guys. Which is fine. I'm not too worried about it. Let's bring the force forward. Get up there, boys. God dang it. Didn't work out quite like I planned, but it never does, right? God dang it. No, not my precious... Probe, you fudger. Okay, good, we got him. Uh, fairly cool. Death Team 4. Refill your ammo and fire when ready. Okay, cool. So, yeah. Pretty much my idea now is to uh, uh, strangle them. And I see all these guys are doing a whole lot of nothing, which, you know, wonderful for you. Ah, gosh dang it. Okay, forget it, forget it, forget it. Just relax, guys. We you only got room to do one thing. Oh, repeat. I hate it how they do that. I hate it how they do that. I just hate it. I hate it how everybody's got to rush up all the time. Come on, I'm trying to select my darn probe, who is overcome with emotion, apparently. I get up here, dude. All right. 
Death Team 4, you need to like earn your pay, dude. Okay, now we're now we're looking pretty. You probably can move back if you want. Aha! Excelente. Crap. Well, actually, that only knocked its shields out, so that's not too bad. Whatever. You guys can like go ahead and scooch back a little bit. That'd be great. Yeah, there's too many, too many uh, threats there. Too many threats. You know, got to be careful here. I know, right? Okay, cool. So you can see the cerebrate right there, which we will take out in just a moment here. God dang it. Whoa, hey boy, hey, hey Brutus Magnus. Stay off him. And of course, yes, I do have to keep provisioning them with ammo. Alright. Yes! Alright, cool. It should be fine. Let me just move in here. Ah, no, 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 not not too fine yet. Dang. That's overkill. There's no kill like overkill. Alright, is there a tool we're going to have to bring him to the front? No, I better not bring Phoenix. Is there a tool is enough? Okay, do not attack the Cerebrate, boys. It's a lot. No, 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 no. No, no, none of that. It's okay, they're finished. Are they finished? I don't know. I feel like they're finished. Go over here. And, uh, let's see. Yeah. You guys, the land forces will be quite enough. Go ahead, take them out. They might have another hatchery somewhere, I guess. Do not attack the frickin'... I don't know if it'll make a mission fail, but I know the computer checks to see if, you know, the Zera tool was one of the ones who hit it. Stop shooting it, you idiot. Okay, go get it, Zera tool. There's nobody around. Geez, if you still needed resources at this point, you could get them, huh? But, uh, we're pretty good on resources right now. Yeah, they must have, uh, like a camp on top of the hill or whatever. But that's hardly relevant. Death Team 4, please continue. Please continue your assault. Okay, you got one. No, they don't go blue when you kill their cerebro, which is bullcrap because they should go blue. Alright. Uh, let's go back to the center because nobody cares anymore. Alright, cool. Alright, take them out. This should be it here. Of course, there was a lot more madness we could have inflicted. 
uh, by taking out the rest of the Browns camp, but uh, really not all that necessary, so let's not waste our time. Not like I haven't wasted my time for probably a lot of this mission, because I'm sure that anybody with half a brain could have done this quicker, but what are you going to do? I like those Zerglites, huh? All right. Okay. Now, I don't... All right. Let's go ahead and check, because the last thing I need is for freaking Zeratul to be killed. Yeah, see? Oh, crap. How much you got, man? The answer is too damn much. No, I think that's... Oh, no, maybe that's not the end of that camp. How long does this camp go on for? Well, whatever. I don't care. Because that's all I was interested in. All right. You guys dip out. Where's my boy? There he is. Cut him up. Yeah. Do you? Alright. Let's just make sure I'm getting away with this. But that should be good. That little turd didn't... He, well, yeah, he tore up my whole camp. With the exception of that. Is that it? No, that's not it. Oh yeah, that's it. Okay, there you go. So hopefully you enjoyed that. Hour 30, not too bad. No, I, I'm pretty happy with that. So you can see we really, yeah, we really took out. That's funny that the, the deaths were far less for the, uh, the, the deaths were a lot worse for the Browns. I guess the Browns mounted more of an offense, whereas I took out the, uh, the white, the Balrog brood a lot more, just kind of uh, upstairs or what have you. And uh, it should have raised a lot more of their structures. No, it's about the same, huh? Well, then I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed that. See you later. Bye-bye.